Okay, uh, Notts County have parted ways this morning with uh, Kevin Nolan. Uh, he's the second Football League manager to fall victim in the space of a couple of days. Scunthorpe United have started uh, the sacking merry-go-round merry this week, and Notts County are now uh, have put put the knives into the back of Kevin Nolan. Um, I think this one's probably more deserved um, that, than the Scunthorpe United sacking. Uh, they did have a good cup run last year in the FA Cup, or last season. Um, they got on TV a few times, got some nice revenues in there for the club. They also made the playoffs, which was crucial for the club. But this season, they haven't kicked on. They haven't started the season strongly. They've really been flat. One point uh, so far, propping up the Football League at the bottom of League 2. And a club of Notts County size falling out of the Football League would be financially catastrophic. We've seen it happen to several Football League clubs that have gone into the non-league. Some haven't survived. Some haven't come back out. Some have actually gone bust and no longer exist. I think he's provided opinion amongst fans. Uh, there are some fans who are in favour of the sacking. There are others who think it's it's really harsh and far too soon. And I'm not going to get drawn. I think it is possibly deserved. But again, in August, sacking your manager, I don't know if that's the right way to go to solve a problem. Um, I, I'm still the I'm still a type of uh, sports fan who says give the coach time, uh, be patient. Um, other clubs have proven that they've been close to sacking managers, kept faith, and that, that managers repaid that faith by fixing the situation. You look at Leicester City uh, with Nigel Pearson, they could have sacked him early on in that season. Uh, he stuck, They stuck faith with him, and the following year they win the Premier League because he kept the club up. But then off-field uh, issues kicked in, and he got fired and Ranieri came in. Um, so Alex Ferguson's a prime example. Could have been sacked multiple times by Manchester United early on in his managerial reign. They kept faith with him. Look how many titles he brought back to Old Trafford. Uh, these are bigger clubs, smaller end of the scale. You want to get promotion or you want to stabilise in the league you're in. Uh, Notts County obviously want to get to League One as, as the first stepping stone on the way back up the Football League ladder. They are a, a club steeped in history and tradition. They're one of the oldest clubs in England. They have got a very large fan base. So you wouldn't, if, that would surprise some people. They've actually got a very large fan base around Nottinghamshire. Yes, their main rivals are not Nottingham Forest. Um, but in the short term, they want to get back to League One. Then they want to kick on to the Championship and hopefully the Premier League will beckon for them one day. Uh, but in recent years, in recent times, there's been money issues. Uh, they've been the lesser of the two Nottingham sides, which irks fans. Um, Nottingham Forest have been more successful in the modern era. That irks fans. Uh, they've had some hit and miss managers, have Notts County. I do think, had the situation carried on and they were struggling in September, then you make the decision uh, to remove Nottingham. I think it's still a bit early. But it is what it is. So Kevin Nolan's gone. Uh, so that means Notts County are in the, in the market for a manager. Um, they need to stay in League Two as a minimum. Uh, obviously, the plan is to, you know, get to League One. And I think they would rather do that via automatic promotion rather than the lottery of playoffs. Because playoffs is where they were last season. And they want to take that next step. Um, but we'll see what happens. Uh, second club this week to sack a manager. Third uh, managerial change in British football. Because Kenny Miller obviously parted ways amicably with Livingston. Through, uh, Scunthorpe have done it and now Notts County have, have, have fired a manager so it's getting a little bit hang on a second um, we're not even out of August yet Crystal Palace hadn't sacked De Burr last season by this point so we're getting earlier and earlier in the sackings now um, there has to come a point where this is unsustainable in football as a whole but he ha Nolan had been there a while uh, and they obviously haven't kicked on as the board wanted maybe he didn't get the signings that he wanted there could have been a disagreement like that but it is what it is I mean, thank you very much for watching uh, please like and subscribe. If you are a Notts County fan, I've, I've seen so divided on social media. Some fans are for the sacking, some fans are against, some fans are undecided whether it's deserved or not. Now, it's, not it's even neutrals as well. Um, place your thoughts below. I'm very interested to hear, uh, hear what you guys have to say, and we'll discuss it on live stream tonight. Anyway, thank you very much for watching, and I'll have some more videos for you soon.